Hey guys, you need to be able to access your home server from another device. Of course, you can use OpenSSH and start a secure shell into your server, but if you have a desktop OS installed on your server, it's nice sometimes just to actually remote desktop into your server and use it like an actual computer. So it's really easy to set up. Let's go ahead and set it up. Okay, when you're logged into your server, first thing that you're gonna do is open up a terminal and let's go ahead and run an update on our apt git. Okay, now we're gonna install xrdp. So that's the service that is gonna allow us to remote desktop into our Linux machine. Okay, now we're gonna go ahead and start the service. So we're gonna do sudo service xrdp start. And now it's running. So the one thing that we need to do is configure our firewall to allow connections. So let's go ahead and do that. Let me check the status of the firewall. We can see it's inactive, so I'm gonna go ahead and enable it. Okay, now that it's enabled, we are going to open up the port. So we're gonna do sudo uf, sudo ufw allow 3389 is the port that XRDP is listening to. So now we just need to check what our IP address is that our router is providing for our server. So I'm gonna do IP address show. And this is the IP address that I'm gonna to wanna to connect to. So in Windows, okay, I'm gonna remote desktop. So let's get our Windows remote desktop. And we're going to, so we're going to do 192.168.4.173. And let's, before I connect, I actually need to go ahead and log off. Otherwise the service is not gonna let me log on remotely. So I'm gonna log off here. And I'm logged out. Machine is still running. So let's try to connect. I'll say yes, and here we go. So let me enter my username and password. And now we have a remote desktop into our server. So again, this is a really nice feature if you have your server stowed away in your closet or somewhere, and you can just remote desktop into it like it's your own computer from your workstation. If you like this video, please hit the like button and subscribe to see more videos like this. I'll see you in the next one. Thanks.